what's good guys it is your boy jason jv saying welcome to another reaction video and yes yes y'all best believe best believe doing my best to try to wrap up uh this album review from my man crypt uh this album of course being his latest one which is called buried alive the next song that is up on deck is a song called there for you and so yeah can't wait to get into this one y'all i'm sure y'all can either hence why you're here so without further ado I'd like to hear here go And I'll be there for you I know it's hard for us To love the way we knew Before they broke our trust And I'll be there for you I know we don't have much That don't matter to me All I need, all I need, all I need, all I want Yo I recognize this voice, even though the YouTube topic channels never show you like who the features are. I recognize this voice. I know for damn sure that is my man Atlas. And props to my man Atlas, man. That dude, that dude can carry a, a, a tune, you know what I'm saying? And I know for most people with the raspy voice, it is not easy to sing with a raspy voice. And Atlas is one of those guys who can pull it off extremely, extremely well, man. So mad respect for that, man. Let's go. On the nights that no one's there, you always are When the phone calls get ignored, I know you're never far And every time my heart aches, you're always there for me to vent So when the world puts its weight on my chest, I breathe with your breaths And from the times I was broke up until Alright, so it sounds like my man is talking about, you know, doing one doing one for those as you would have them do one for you Talking about, you know, how someone was there for him And I'm guessing what he's trying to get at is he's trying to return the favor I could be wrong though. Let's get back into it. The time I was rich, you never switched how you treated me. You see me the way I wish. You always hold me to the highest standards, unafraid to let me fall. Because when I get back up, you know it's better just to dust me off and let me learn by example and toughen up my thoughts. Sometimes you got to touch the stove just to know it's hot, and you can tell me not to touch it. Okay, man, you talking about some life lessons he had to learn. You know what I mean? He he had to learn to fall and pick himself up, dust himself off. You know what I mean? And, um, yeah, man, sometimes, hey, you got to touch that stove, that oven, whatever the case may be, to understand what it, what it, what hot feels like. You know what I mean? It's a painful lesson, but, hey, as long as you learn, right? Let's go. did a hundred times, but until my skin is burned, I'll never know what the pain is like. No, I never want that pain again. That's like our relationship. Every time when things get tough, I think of parting ways, but then I think about the days before we ever existed and realize I could. Yo, I can relate to what he was saying right there. You know what I mean? Um, talking about a, a, a reoccurring relationship, you know, an on-again, off-again relationship with my ex. We've had on-again, off-again. We've been on-again, off-again for a little while. Now I'm pretty much done with her. You know what I mean? Uh, right. But like I said, because, see, here's the thing. My ex, she was one of those girls that, um, I don't know, for some reason, you know what I mean, I couldn't stay away from her. Want to give her another chance, hope and hope that that you know it would work out that time, you know what I mean, or this time or whatever the case. Um, but then you know something would happen, you know what I mean. Whether it's my fault, her fault, or both, you know what I mean. Somehow, some way, shit will start off nice. It would be all sunshine, rainbows, and butterflies. But then I don't know, maybe something I did, something I said, something she did, something she said, or maybe it was both of us. But either way, the relationship would always have a rocky end. Um, just the last time though, to be fair, we did have a nice subtle end to our relationship and we just agreed to, you know, well, if anything, we can be friends, you know what I'm saying? And we, we can talk and stuff like that. You know what I mean? So try to keep it civil, you know what I mean? And, uh, yeah, let's get back into this. Actually, <laughs> sorry, y'all. I'm a little, I'm a little distracted. Um, but, um, trying, trying to finish my thoughts here. But yeah, I don't know, man. It's just, it, it was one of those things where like you knew, you you knew how it was gonna end, but yet I was I, was, I knew how it, the, the relationship would end, but yet I had to keep trying. I had to keep trying. I had to keep giving it a chance. I had to you know try to hope and pray that things would be different. But you know, it is what it is. Let's get back into it. Couldn't last without you a single and minute. I'll be there for you. I know it's hard for us. 
I just love that hook from Atlas, man. That's that's a that's a beautiful hook, man. Let's go. And messages from fans saying that I saved their life, saying I'm the man, saying that without me and this music that I make, that their life would have ended long ago, and that's hard to take because I know how many times I've tried to take my own life, and you're the one that stopped me and told me to go home and write. So really, it's you. You're the one that we should all thank. You brought me closer to my family and even closer to faith. You brought me into the life of a family. Sounds like this person that he's talking about here, they were really tight, really close, saying that, man, they, they because of them, you know what I mean, he became, what, tighter with his family, he became um, closer to God, you know what I mean, more uh, closer to his faith, you know what I mean, bruh, let's go. When, when my records were spun, and to my homie Ben, just know that you've done much more for me than I could ever do for you, and I know that's hard to see, you made me fall back in love with the one I wrote this song about, and reminded me of the from the stove inside of my house I'd rather live one day with her Than a thousand without her laugh I call her the love of my life You can call her rap be there for you. So for him uh, The love of his life he, The one the one thing he really loved about her Was her laugh You know what I mean And Maybe I don't know Maybe it was In the, in the case that I was making for myself earlier With my ex You know what I mean I don't know Maybe there was just some, There was just something about her That I just couldn't stay away from I couldn't live without You know what I mean Bruh Love Love is Is a crazy dangerous game That's all I'm gonna say about that I'm gonna leave it there Let's go I know it's hard for us To love the way We knew Before they broke our trust Alright, there we go again with the shovel. But anyways, y'all, that was Crit with There For You and Yo. This was actually a really nice song. You know what I mean? It really was. I, I love the instrumental. I love, of course, the, um, Crit's uh, storytelling abilities, you know what I'm saying, with the song. Um, I love that, yeah, it, the, 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 the flow, it was more consistent throughout this song. But, I mean, that, that's to be expected for the storytelling element. Um for his verse, you know what I'm saying, which I really dig, I really, really loved, um, Atlas's, uh, part, you know what I'm saying, with the hook and everything, I, I was just, this was just very well done, you know what I mean, so yeah, I think both these guys, they really, really work well together, you know what I mean, they really brought this song together, so, yeah, man, I'm, I'm all about it, man, this will probably be one of those ones that I will revisit, you know what I'm saying, but anyways, y'all, as you can probably tell, with all that being said, I am definitely with the song 100%. You know what I'm saying? And uh, if y'all are too, well, you know to do that link for the original video. That'll be in the description down below. And uh, if y'all feeling this reaction, you know to do that thumbs up down below. And you know what to do with that comment section down below. And if you're new here, welcome. Thank you for your view. Very much appreciate it. And hopefully I did enough to earn your subscription so you can be part of Jason JV Ranger Squad family. Oh, and by the way, as an update, uh, excuse me. In the previous uh, reaction, um, I did ask that if you guys want to know the origin story uh, for the Ranger Squad name, and so uh, yeah, some some y'all spoke up and said yeah, you would like to hear that that story. You want to see that vlog? Um, I will try to get that done by this weekend, as I will have more time to do it then. So uh, yeah, please bear with me. But yeah, I'll probably have it out hopefully by Saturday, if not Sunday at the latest. So yeah, definitely stay tuned for that. And, uh, yeah. So, where was I? Yeah, if you want to be a part of the Ranger, the Jason JV Ranger Squad family, would definitely love to have you as part of the team. Yeah, what I mean? Don't forget to check out, of course, all the links in the description down below, including the two store links. 
such as the Teespring merch store link and the Kula Hawaii link if you're interested at all in any uh, CBD, uh, Delta 8, CBG products. You know what I'm saying? Got that link for that store in the description down below, as I mentioned. And uh, if you want to just donate to the channel, help out with the cause, link for the PayPal in the description down below as well. Now, if you absolutely cannot support the channel financially, no worries. It is all good. I understand. No hard feels. You are still helping out in the long run by simply clicking that subscribe button, dinging that notification bell. Make sure you select all so you never miss an upload, which doesn't cost a single red cent, but still a big help nonetheless. If you're new here, of course, and of course, liking and sharing my videos so more eyes can be on the channel. Since teamwork makes a dream work, you best believe I cannot be picked up on the YouTube algorithm without y'all, and I recognize. And I think I nailed everything, guys. So with all that being said, it is your boy, Jason JV, saying y'all take care. Have a blessed one. I catch y'all in the next one. All right, peace.